It's been a few days since I last played this, but I believe we uh, did a lot of back and forth across the Americas, and actually kind of everywhere, um, because we've got a boat now. So, uh, did as much exploration as I possibly could. It does seem like there's a couple of places that there isn't stuff to do in yet, but there probably will be eventually. Um, but for the time being, clearly the next progression was in the Great Lakes Cave area, and that's what we're heading into now. So, let's see what we've got there. And let's get the timer rolling again. And... We should be in, yeah, near Lake right outside of there. We're heading right in here. Right, because, so, it was really unexpected how we ended up getting progression for this, because, um, I don't know, somewhere, somewhere offshore there was, uh, I don't know, a tower with, I guess, uh, a mermaid tower or something, but there was, like, monsters that were, uh, disrupting everything and sailors couldn't do the sailor things. And, uh, yeah, yeah, Super Metroid was, was the first run-in that I had with crap like that. Um, I still think that's the most high effort of any of the ones that I've, uh, seen so far, but... So, you know, they at least deserve a slight amount of credit for their asshattery. But, um... But yeah, so when we cleared out the, the tower that was causing all the trouble for the sailors, I think in the South American area, for some reason one of the mermaids was actually the girlfriend of the dude who was standing here taking up space preventing us from entering. And she gave us something to give to him, uh, the, their engagement ring, and now he's gotten the heck out of Dodge, so now we can continue. Oh, okay, yeah, we've, I remember these fish. And I'm one-shotting them, so like, when I first came in here, I was thinking, like, this looks a whole lot like an area I was in in the previous chapter, but I don't think I had ever gotten access to the Great Lakes area before. So, I'm pretty sure this is new. Oh, well, that's new, because apparently they don't instantly die. What the holy crap? Well, I guess I'm over here again now. How to speedrun in the wrong direction. Okay, so they just get to- they get to have the final word, apparently. Error. Is that a- is that a special item? Seems like it might be a special equipable thing, or an always active thing, or something. Uh, wait, I was already on the item screen. I wasn't paying attention to what screen I was on. I was just looking at the doors. Uh, yeah. I'm also wondering, like, what did I miss that I'm- that there's nothing in this second slot? Like, you start with the jewel box, and then I got the giant leaves and the sharp claws, but, like, there's something that should be here that isn't, and that really has me kind of worried. Uh, so what does this do? For breathing underwater. Oh. So now we have... Like, we could already swim. And that was the giant leaves doing. But apparently now we can submerge, I guess. And that might be what those little... What this, the dots up here were about. Uh, how do we submerge, though? Or is that what this is about? Nope. Nope, yes it is. I was just pressing the wrong button. We're actually playing Star Tropics now. Uh, which is funny, because actually, uh, Bug Doctor has resumed his blindfolded playthrough of that tonight, as well. I think he was at least... He was, like, halfway through Chapter 3. He managed to beat Maxi. I don't know how the hell he managed to do that, but he did. Oh, that's not... okay. Can't submerge there. Do I want to go down that waterfall? Also, can I... do I stand any chance of killing these things? I feel like they're kind of just a hazard. Problem is, you don't know which way they're going, either. I feel like there's no other way to go anyway, so I might as well just, uh, go down here.
Okay, this is, yeah, so we've got, like, multiple new forms, uh, or, or recolors, palette swaps of enemies that we have experienced in earlier areas. Okay, so there's stairs there. What do we got here? Oh, that loops back around, I think? This looks like where I was before. I'm assuming that this is indeed where I- yeah, where I was before. Uh... Okay, so... I feel like this game changes its mind as to... which direction it... the floors go. Like, right now, 2F is actually up here. But I feel like there's been other cases when that has been the opposite. That shadow. What? Okay. What is that shadow? Help! Someone help! What? Thought I heard someone. Okay. Can't I hurt that thing? Whoa, I almost fell down. Why can't I hurt these? I could hurt the other ones. Oh, because it's closed. Yeah, okay. You can only hurt it when it's open. Uh, I don't suppose I can swim up waterfalls? No, not really. Uh, would you like to surface and get up there? Why do you... Is there a current going? Yeah, there's a current carrying me. Okay. Which is also why I almost fell down the waterfall. Uh, so I have no idea how to get up there right now. Right, any option but to fall down? Gravely poisoned? Oh, well, shit. Uh, can I even use items while I'm down here? Let's, uh... Yeah, now that I've lost, like, a hundred health, I do have a couple of things that I might want to equip right now. So first of all, let's use a poison cure. What? Okay, so apparently serum is for grave poison. So, I had been asking for a while, rhetorically, why- what does this serum item do if I've already got pea bulbs that cure poison? And the descriptions were not clear at all. They both sound like they cure poison. It's like, okay, why are there two of them? And apparently the reason is there is a separate status called grave poison, which is even more bullshit than the poison status. And poison cure can't cure grave poison. Only serum can. So, guess I'll die, then. And it, it seems like, uh... Also, these guys just don't... ...die, apparently. I'm not gonna be able to do anything here, I'm just gonna die. Yep. Because the problem with poison is it never wears off. Alright, so let's go to the shop here. That's why I figured I would just let it kill me anyway. There was no sense in doing anything. Uh, where did we have a shop that sold serum? I know I've seen it in one or two places. Actually, where the hell is the shop even? Don't, they, don't the shops usually have markings on them? Here, is it? I don't think so. I may have to go to it. No, it's not. This is the, uh, this is Will's house. 
So, the other thing that I was going to do is I was going to re-equip armor that guards against poison, but I'm not sure if it guards against grave poison anyway, so I'm not even sure if that idea will help. Uh... What am I wearing right now? Okay... Is this the one? Yeah, this one claims to block poison. It's quite a downgrade, though. I mean, I can try wearing it and see what happens. Of course, if it's only the projectiles from those plants that causes poison, those are... not the worst thing to have to avoid, like, as long as I'm kind of careful about it. Okay, seriously, is there even a shop? I'm not sure there's even a shop here. Unless it's in the inn. Oh, is it over here? Uh... Yeah, it is. Do you have serum? You do not have serum. Where did I see that sold? Man, now tonight is actually going to be trying to find Serum again. Not actually dungeon crawling as we expected to. Alright, well, let's check here first. I might have to go to another continent altogether, though. Now, I want to think that this town does, does have a separate shop. Yeah. That's Magic Shop, though, isn't it? No, that's the pub, actually. I can't tell what these icons above the doors mean. Is that actually an exit? That, yeah, it's not like the other town where that actually goes somewhere. <laughs> this is what happens when I haven't played in half a week, is I don't remember where stuff is. Wasn't there an upper section of this town, though? No, I'm thinking of a different town. Uh, so if there's a shop in here, it's unmarked. Actually, what is this dude's deal? I forgot. Didn't this guy want to cook things, too? Wait a sec. Do I have... Do, do I have food? Did the dude in the other town give me food? No, I have wine, but I don't know that that's what he wants. I mean, I can try it. Nope, doesn't seem interested in wine. But I feel like I should have gotten a hamburger from the dude in the other town. Yo, the shop is right here, isn't it? Yep. Yep, no serum. What? Jeez, dude. Yeah, I have everything. Oh man, where did I see Serum? I guess we're gonna go take a boat somewhere. I really hope it wasn't, like, all the way in the Asian continent. This was the auto, okay. Uh... Yes, serum. Okay. Alright, so now, now we've, uh... 
Got some stuff to hedge our bets. We're, we have the armor equipped that may or may not protect against grave poison. It protects against poison. And now we've got serum, which, well, I can't, uh... Once I can open the menu again, I'll, I'll show what I'm talking about with how confusing this is. What the heck was that? That was some weird musical glitch. Alright, so yeah, if I go in the menu here... So we've got P-Cure, instantly cures a poisoning. And then we've got Serum, eliminates deadly poisons. So I didn't know that Grave Poison was a separate status effect, because poison is already such a frickin' crappy status effect, why would you make something even worse? But they did. Hey, Wax Goat. It's like somebody on the dev team seriously thought, you know, poison isn't shitty enough, we're gonna make something even worse. Now it's like they had Pippin on the dev team. Yes, we've already got poisoning. What about second poisoning? Wow, that was an interesting dodge. Uh, wait, I don't need to go back here, do I? Just need to go here. And then we're going here. Those are the things I want to avoid. Okay, so now we need to go down. Or up, whatever direction that is. Uh, and then the question is... I guess we're just going down this waterfall. Wait, is this a thing? No, I guess not. Now, these things I can't seem to hurt, because it seems like I just bounce off of them. Or that happens, apparently. Uh, and now we've got either that option, or... this option. We seem to have a lot of options right now, actually. That doesn't seem like much of an option, though. So I guess we'll try up here. He almost got me. He did get me. Jeez, 10... 1,000... 10.25 on that guy. That's where I just came from. Where else can we go? Also, this room does feel familiar. This room has me thinking I was here in the previous chapter. But it might just be similar. I don't know how the hell you're supposed to get up there. Oh, let me double check that I have the best weapon on right now, actually. I mean, not that... Not that that's really a concern at the moment, because I'm beating the snot out of everything. Yeah, that should be the best one. What? It doesn't tell you which, though. Weapons, armor, or items. One of the three is overloaded. I shouldn't be overloaded on items. I'm not... I have a whole third row here. What do you mean I'm overloaded? Oh, unless I actually have nine of something. 
Also, I can use these. I wonder if they'll let you discard the, uh, the dog whistle. Like, the thing is, some of these were key items, but they're probably, like, useless now, but... I don't know if any of them ever have another use. Okay, no, seriously, what am I overloaded on? None of these things look like they're full. Like, it looks like I have two spots left for armor here. And there's another on the bottom right, so that shouldn't be an issue either. I'm very confused as to what it thinks I'm overloaded on, uh, but we can... That's not great. Okay, you can still see that, but it's kind of not great that you can't even see where you're pointing. Alright, trash it is. I guess I'm just going to try trashing one of each thing. But, like, if there's a nothing here slot, then there shouldn't be a problem. Like, I definitely have space. Okay, so it's a weapon. Are these center ones not available to me for some stupid reason? Because, like, they're slots that exist. I mean, like, they do look different. So I guess those aren't real slots, even though I can totally select them and it says there's nothing there. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, alright. We got an even better staff, apparently. Oh, that's new. And it's not even just a reversal, it's like, a rotation. No, now it's a reversal. It was a rotation before, then. Does this not wear off? I mean, as long as that thing's not actually attacking me, it's not the worst. But if this never wears off, that's kind of a problem. Oh, I'm not confused anymore. Cool. I guess that wears off when you go... and when you change rooms? But poison doesn't wear off like that. It'd be great if it did. Uh... What was the point of that? Alright, let's take a look at the map. Yeah, that seems kind of pointless. And there's seemingly nothing else down here. I don't know if the blue is supposed to mean something. Oh! I see. Well, that changes things, I guess. You can attack that. Oh, and that's how you get to this. Okay. And now we can get over there. So that's new. Like, I guess that was supposed to convey, like, you know, a sort of crack in the wall. 
It's not exactly the, gr the clearest conveyance. Wait, I can hit them? I like how the one behind it died, apparently. Oh, and now we're... okay. This is how we got here. Geez, surprise. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. Well, I guess this water just exists to, uh, have fish that cause problems. Alright, there's a door down there. And there's whatever the heck is going on there. I feel like maybe I should just check this door first. Although I have a feeling that this is just sort of a penalty area for if you fall up there. Yeah, seems that way. Alright, let's see if we can make sense of this. That goes extremely fast. Yeah, so how the heck is that supposed to work? supposed to work. Oh, pfft. wow. Well, if he dropped stuff, I'm gonna go get it, I guess. So we already got progression in terms of, like, the diving item. Oh, that's cool that I can actually get back up there. I can't dive in there at all. Like, I'm just thinking, there can't possibly be a second bit of progression in this dungeon, can there? I just walked right into that. Many other places that there's... There's one set of stairs here that I haven't been down, and there's a set of stairs there that I haven't been down. Which has me kind of suspicious. I don't know that it would make sense to go all the way the heck back up, but... I don't know what the point of those things is either, because it seems like there's no way to actually kill them. I am smart. I also don't know what the goal here would be, though. I, I feel like... Like, the only recourse is to go back. Let's see if there's anything else I can do. I didn't actually explore in here. I mean, this seems to work. Sometimes I still don't really get the rhyme or reason to that. Okay. I tried to jump attack and then actually, like, ran into him. Let's just leave.
Is it if I hit them sideways? That seems to always work. Like, if they come into it sideways. around this whole thing. Well, you know what? I should have actually gone backwards that way. If I wanted to check the beginning of the dungeon again. Wow, cool. I just freaking like, dive-bombed into there and obliterated half of them. Let me through, thank you. I guess you actually have to either go down there or down the waterfall. Shit, I didn't want to do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna end up down here anyway. Wait, there's something to the left. Holy crap. Alright, well that gives me something to do. I was just barely not far left enough. Didn't quite work. Oh, jeez. Not much in the way I frames there. If I wanna... Do you mind? I can't actually go back that way. That kinda stinks, actually. Alright. Is this gonna land somewhere? Yes, it is. Magic anchor. Oh, that might be what we need. Secures footing in swift currents. Yep, you're, this is basically your iron boots. Doesn't work in waterfalls, though. And I guess it doesn't actually ground you. But yeah, there was actually two progression items in one dungeon. That seems a bit hasty. Wait, is this the wrong way? No, this is the right way. Jeez, that one really wanted it. Alright, so now we should be able to go through here? Yeah, now it just doesn't bother us at all. Alright, so there's stuff over here. those guys. It would be cool if I could actually attack while I'm in the water, but I totally can't. Nope, seems like this is the only only place to go. Oh boy, lots of points of no return here. Guess I'm actually going in here? Yeah, there's something in there. Okay. I wonder where the heck we are right now. We're still going down. 
Oh, we might actually be at the bottom. Okay, but there's two ways to go here. <clears throat> okay, there's two ways to go here. Where's the other one go? They clearly don't meet back up at the other end. Actually, there's another... Jeez, apparently this is a big maze. Maybe it does meet back up in the middle. There's some kind of speed tech to this. Like, if I hit a wall, it allows me to, uh, to swim again. Alright, well, we found something. Uh, let me look at this and see... Seems like there's only the one... well... It shows another shoreline over there. That makes it seem like there could be something else in here. Alright, that might not actually be speed tech, because it seems like when you hear the other swimming noise, it doesn't actually, like, go anywhere. Uh... There's nothing here. Okay. I was thinking there might be an item or something on the other land, but there wasn't. I mean, unless, unless there's another item elsewhere. We know where this is now. That is, if I can remember where it is. And keep looking around a bit. I think this is where I went around the first time. Yeah, this is totally where I went around the first time. I'm wondering if I can come back out the top. Oh, there's also... Hmm... I don't know if I want to go down there or not. That would be an, a one-way trip, whereas the staircase is not necessarily a one-way trip. Actually, wait. Is where I came from, though? I think it is. Yep, it is. So then I guess the waterfall is the way to go. There are still a couple of staircases that are unexplained, though. Like, much earlier in the dungeon. I can't look at the map right now. Uh... No, that is the right one. Boss time? What the hell is that? Hit to Duran... Some, I didn't even read the whole message, I was just trying to figure out its name. Oh, cool. Well, this seems okay. Do I have to use magic against this guy? How does this fucking work? I'm just getting absolutely generated. I don't know that I'm actually accomplishing anything. Oh, well, I'm dead. But like, 
Seriously, I can't actually attack the dude in the distance. So, uh, how is that supposed to work? Unless they suddenly require you to use magic, which seem which would seem kind of rude because magic is in very short supply. Alright, well there were, like I said, a couple of things near the start that I seemingly haven't explored, so I'm kinda of curious about that first. Uh like Actually no, wait, they're all checked off now. All right, I stand corrected. Then we just need to freaking go back through all this. <laughs> okay. got an extra level out of it, so I suppose that's, uh, potentially worthwhile. Oh, also... I should probably put my better armor back on. Pretty sure that's not the best armor. It's a little time consuming to go back through. I didn't want to start wasting healing items until I had an idea of what's going on, though. And I definitely don't want to waste magic until I have an idea of what's going on. I didn't save before this time. I might save next time if I end up... Torments Gossi. Oh, so yeah, we are just supposed to freaking. We're just supposed to fight the starfish. They're tormenting me, too. Now it's mad at me because it's like, oh, there's the starfish, it's on him. Have I actually killed all the other starfish? Is it just this one now? Oh, I missed. You have to actually stop for it to... to commit to targeting you. Okay, that was actually the fight. 
The starfish are gone. You can you can stop being mad now. Uh, are are we doing anything? We defeated we defeated them by doing. Well, no, yeah, Hitadaren was what was what was tormenting Gossi to begin with. So yeah, Gossi looks intently at you. I obtained the horn pin. Yeah, Gossi actually reminds me a little bit of a D-Force boss. I don't understand your language, but I guess you want to help me. But where are you taking me now? Where the heck are you? Yahoo! I'm saved. I have no idea who you are, but thank you. I'm Will- Oh, holy shit, it's Will. I'm Will. Ever since I was a kid, I studied flying free as a bird. This is basically this game's Sid equivalent. I finally made it. My dream machine called an airplane. On my test flight, I crashed into the Great Lakes. I was attacked by these strange beasts like starfish. A huge dragon suddenly appeared and shielded me. The lake god really existed. I want to repay you, so come with me. I have something to show you. Yep, here we are. So, you were Pearl's friend. No one was hurt, but I can't go on. I can't get the parts anymore. Lon Trade and Yunko began buying up metal for the parts. Oh, well, I know where Yunko is. That's one of the places that I didn't know what to do with yet. I scrapped together the last two parts to make that plane. Ugh. Oh, and she just showed up. Okay. Alright, well, we have places to go now, then. But let me, uh, save. So yeah, like, initially I was I was fixated on Gossie in that boss fight, not realizing that it's really just there as a hazard. And once I just fo that, that's what I was thinking the second time, was just let me just focus on the starfish for a while and, uh, pfft, go figure, the problem resolves itself when you do that. Um, because otherwise you're trying to focus on too much stuff at once anyway. Alright. Wasn't there one other thing I wanted to check in here, actually? Oh yeah, I wanted to see if I can get a burger. Where was Burger Guy? Here. Okay, I can't actually get one. Either that or I already have it and I just didn't notice, but I didn't notice. Let me go check again. Also, let's just get rid of this S-bulb now. Because I really don't need to be- I don't need to be holding on to that. Yeah, and go figure, I didn't end up needing this serum at all. I guess- I wish you could sell things in this. Like, it stinks that you have to just get rid of stuff. And I guess I should get rid of some more stuff, too. Given that apparently I'm full up on weapons because the four slots in the middle that are clearly empty don't count. Alright. Uh, oh, right. The one other thing I wanted to do, actually, is... Let's see if Peril is in the, uh... In the place that he left me before. Should be up here or something? No, it's further up. Not here anyway. where Peril is to tell him. Alright. I 
actually, I wonder what's the fastest way to get over there. Because it's basically halfway around the world. Probably would have been faster to go, like... Well, no, not necessarily up north. Yo, I didn't know New Zealand was actually on the map. That's pretty neat. Can I land there? There's a port, but it's, like, guarded by rocks everywhere. Apparently it's New Zealand circa 220 when they cut off all immigration. Wait, nope, I can get in. Never mind. Okay, it looked like there was nothing here, but there's something here. You know, I was expecting some killer kangaroos in Australia. Maybe they'll be in New Zealand instead. in this right now, but actually, I'm not sure... Did I ever go in here? I never went in here. Tropical sun sets the hearts of men and women on fire. Great place. Maybe trying to do Aussie accents. I'm not good at doing Aussie accents. I'll leave if this town has turned into a tourist attraction. That's okay, as long as you have killer kangaroos, you don't have to worry about that. Isn't this a nice place? We don't get many visitors, so it's quiet. The leaders are apparently trying to attract more visitors. Also, for some reason, this place uses the same music as America. Whoa, this guy has, like, everything. What the hell is this? Instantly lifts a death curse. Okay. Um... I've never been inflicted with any kind of curse ailment whatsoever. But we know that's here now. Uh, that's worse than what I'm using right now anyway. But it has thunder element, I guess. There's that posh suit again, which I have no reason to buy. Also, interesting, that store actually has two entrances. For the single room. Uh, I just talked to that guy. Okay, too bad. It is a nice place, but coming with another guy. Wow, alright. I here by boat from Litz. This is a nice town. This is the oasis of my soul. I'm gonna keep it a secret. Good job keeping it a secret by immediately telling me. Ah, oh, well, there's your tourist shop. The tourist bureau pro provides information on travel in other cities. People here can learn of other lands through us, but we don't have enough information on other lands. Maybe you shouldn't have started a tourist bureau, then. If you have photos of other lands, I would love to see them. They know about photography, though. Uh, interesting. So I do have a camera that I have not remembered to use whatsoever. I guess I should, like, take pictures in other towns. Maybe that's a thing you can do. Coconut cheese. Ten gems. Sure. The sun feels great. Heaven. 
Uh, is it already over here? To the west of Suncoast is a huge stone mountain named Ayers Rock. As opposed to Ayers Rock? The scientist there said he was going to observe the end of Earth. The world is so peaceful, and yet we still have disturbed people. I don't think disturbed is quite the right word. People don't come here because we're an island. If we had access... People that come by boat all get to like this village. This town has many attractions. The food is great. The koalas are cute. We don't get many visitors. I wonder what's wrong. Uh, maybe, you know, that whole big fat ocean thing. We hold meetings every day for promoting our vis village worldwide. Wait, was there...? How do you propose I get that magic rock? I've never seen a magic rock in an out of reach place before. What am I yakking about all day long? I'd rather not see many strangers coming into this quiet place. Can't jump up there either. I don't know if the koala up there means anything. Alright, well, there's a magic rock that I have no idea how to get to. Uh, this looks like it goes somewhere. It does. There are cows there. Hang on. Before we go there, there's also more... Wait, no. I went in this one, right? Yeah. Anything else this way? Welcome. All you can eat seafood smorgasbord for just 15 gems. We take pride in our low prices. I mean, 15 gems seems pretty good. I'm, I'm eating all of this to- Oh, I, li I like the graphics when you're done. Although the fact that everything disappears and then the remains end up on the plate has me a little worried about uh, our protagonist's priorities. I can't eat that. I can't access that. Come on, this is a travesty. Alright, cool. I'm, I'm vicariously uh, making up for the local Japanese seafood buffet being closed since the beginning of the pandemic by eating all the seafood in the game right now. That is definitely the one thing I miss most from pre-pandemic. Alright, what do you have to say about... Uh, this place. This town desires progress, but its location is extremely bad. Man. Your location is rubbish. Attracting people and promoting the town's name are essential. This town's economic index is 0%. I feel like that's an understatement, given that it's in the middle of nowhere. My beef is the best in the world. I wonder how I could let the whole world know about my beef. Can you advertise for me? Yeah, I know exactly who to give it to. A single bite is worth a thousand words. I'll give you a sample. Give this to someone who can appreciate this sample. Well, actually, okay, I can think of two people that might want this. Alright, I think we've done all we can do here for now. What else is in here? Is this Ayers Rock? This is Ayers Rock. Do anything here yet? Possibly not. Oh, we can climb here. I wonder how much trouble I can get myself in. Although there was just supposed to be a dude pondering the end of the world or something here, right? Uh... But he's here. So, uh... Perhaps later. I'm 
guessing it's too early for this anyway. Yeah, I had a feeling there might be something hiding in here. I think we need like a Monty Python intermission here. Do, 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 do. Of course I picked the wrong one, you piece of shit. Asshole game design, right there. Life potion. 228 gems. This is also something. Where does this even bring me? I didn't know there was a stopover that comes here. I'm I, I'm just curious where this goes. And we get to hear I can't believe it's not Gradius music while we're at it. Because, like, does this suggest that I should have been able to access... Also, we should check out Polonies also. That was one of the... I think that might have been one of the extra areas that we unlocked in the first chapter. Yeah, I'm wondering where this bird hails from. Oh, it's from another random tiny little forest thing. Okay. What if both sides were actually stopovers? And now we're in Alaska or something. I think I checked this place out once before. in there. I didn't realize it was a single thing. Oh, that was the Alaska and Australia one. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure there's a port or something here too, though, because I got here without relying on a bird. Yeah, there's a port right here. Okay. Okay, that didn't take us too far off the beaten path. We can get to where we need to go. But also, where exactly was Polonies? I guess it was the island in the center? There is a port here. Friend, you came here expecting a fancy resort, didn't you? The ultimate luxury is relaxing where nothing can disturb you. Arf arf. Nice in the tropical sun. Want to catch a nap? Sure. Didn't even bother laying down. Why am I toasted? I was crisply toasted. My macho appeal went up 10 points. Wow, nice. And that's literally all that's there. How do you guys live there if all it is is a couple of beds and no shelters? I can't believe that being treated like a Subway sandwich caused my macho points to go up. Is this the town I'm looking for? This is the town that I am looking for. There's probably a save point here. Yeah, there is. Okay. Um, I might take a break, actually. And then we'll see what we're looking for here when I get back. But, uh... We're looking for, for airplane parts, I guess? So, we'll, uh... We'll see what happens in a bit. Another pretty cool remix right here. Unfortunately, we gotta turn it down now, because we're getting back into things. 
Uh, let me get the timer going again. And let's see if we can find our parts. Oh, here's our fortune teller. Why not? We haven't done this in a while. Running fast brings luck, but new shoes are needed. What? Didn't it already say that? Didn't we already... I feel like we already did something related to that, and now I forget. This is one of the places that I had seen serum. And unfortunately, all of these things are not as good as what I have on any anyway. Bond trading, that's right. Bond trading at the sad drugstore. It looked like no business anymore. Before, Lon worked with his brother Wong. I wonder what happened. Hmm. Bond trading is what we're looking for. There you go. And charge into things. Maybe that's how we get that Magirock. Thief hide on some island. You can't possibly mean Polonies. Unless it means Cameo. Oh, speaking of Magirock. Here's the drugstore, I guess. But nobody's here. There are many strange diseases, my job is to cure them. Watch sick people carefully, you always find why they are sick. Oh, let's use this. give this to this guy. Nope, guess not. Doesn't let me do anything with it. Oh. Go figure, that's a door. Salon, he upstairs. He not talked to you, though. He acts strange lately. Who are you? My business is finished. I not care about you. Well, uh, I don't have. Don't suppose we have anything we can show him. Maybe if we get him drunk, I don't know. I mean, what about the fever medicine? Nope, that doesn't do anything. Try to get him drunk. Nope. Alright, does anything else special happen after we do that? Oh, something about the brother. They run business together. Mr. Lon acts strange after Wong go away. They fight, maybe? Uh, wait, does she say anything about where the brother is? That door is seriously just, like, snuck in there. It looks completely different from every other door in the entire town. And you expect it to just be a window like what's across from it on the other side of those vendors, but it's not. I just realized that sign actually says Enix. That's fun. Was this another double door, same shop feel? No, it was not.
Oh, the right, that was the fortune teller. But actually, wait, what's upstairs from this guy? Oh, that was where that was. Okay, yep. Alright, so we gotta find Wong. There's a lot of people in here. Came to see Dragon Castle, but it's not open to the public. Darn. Yeah, I tried going in there once. No one know why who no one know who or why anyone wants to buy castle. Lately strange people be seen around castle. It's very spooky. This town have many places you see you can go see beside Dragoon Castle. Can't talk to the other one over there. Dragoon Castle was used by royal people a long time ago. I was tour guide at Dragoon Castle for many years. Now there's no work. I don't suppose we would have any luck whatsoever trying to go into that castle now. I expect it to be the exact same as before. Who are you? This place be off limits to General Republic. Yep, can't go in. Wait, can't go anywhere else? I don't think so. But I'm also not sure what I would need the speed shoes for exactly yet anyway. So, someone said something about a thief on an island. Well, there's an island over there with a port on it. I've been here before. Alright, we can go under there. We can also go under here. Another life potion. Oh, wait. I'm looking at the item. That's a dead end. Okay. Oh, so they actually just hid the speed shoes here. It's not even that the thief has to be found. Okay. And that's what goes in that slot. I don't know why the last item for one of these slots that you get goes into the first one of the slots, but there you go. Is that gonna make me go even faster, or is it more just about... I don't know that I'm any faster, I think it's just about crashing into things. So I wonder whether the speed shoes will interest Lon. Yeah, I'm not I'm not sure that I'm any faster. Let's save again since we found that. I could have gotten I have to imagine I could have gotten this before actually. And I just didn't notice that island. Unless the, unless that port doesn't exist until later. Still doesn't say anything. Uh, let me see if this says anything. Like, it doesn't say anything about any specific, like, inputs. I don't imagine that this will make any difference for getting into the castle. But I'll check. Nope, apparently not. I suppose I could go to the fortune teller again and see if she says something different now that I have the shoes. But it's not clear to me what the shoes do. Nope. 
exactly the same thing. I can't, like, hold the button in place to make him go faster or anything. I can't, like, pressing the button multiple times doesn't seem to do anything. Was it the talk to- was it the- it wasn't the one in the shop, was it? That talked about the speed shoes? Also, I'm assuming this just exits the town, but I could be wrong. No? Yeah, it just exits. the one that talked about that. It wasn't someone in the, uh... It wasn't someone in here, was it? I don't remember who the heck told me about that. town talked about it. This guy. But you run like wind and charge into things. Yeah, so we did that. But I'm not sure I believe that it lets you run into thing- uh, run- run like the wind or charge into things. there's some meaning behind those parents, too. Alright, well, do I even remember, was Australia where that one Magirock on a shelf was? Like, I kind of want to see if that works. Also, yeah, Kamiyo is right there. You would think that you would think that the purpose of it is in that town. Now, of course, I don't remember which house it was. This was the, uh, buffet. This is the house it was. Well, that doesn't do anything. Unless there's controls to it that I don't understand. Actually, hang on a sec. They're not equipped! That's my entire problem. I'm actually an idiot. Okay, so it's actually, like... That still doesn't work, though. I was thinking that would be the point. So... Oh, wait. Don't tell me. I can't believe I just didn't think to equip. Because, like, the other things down there, you don't have to equip. 
So I just thought it was, like, always active, the way that, like, the flipper equivalent is. But no, it's not. You have to equip it. And then use the item button. So it's basically like the Pegasus boots. Wait, did I go too far up? Yes. Alright, so now... Is the idea just to freaking dash past this dude? Somehow I doubt that's gonna work. That did not work. It just stopped me dead. Yeah, it just stops you dead. Alright, so... Remains to be seen... What the purpose of this is. smack into him, but I can't do anything with him. So, it's not clear to me what purpose these shoes serve. Can I think of anything anywhere? That would have been, like, speed locked? Also, can I jump? I cannot jump while I'm doing this. I didn't have them equipped before, but... I'm really not sure where I would make particular use of this. Like, yeah, you can definitely charge into things, but I'm not sure what that... what purpose that serves. This is the town I need to be in. Unless there's unless there's something else close by aside from the castle and the town. Cause like, where did that dude's brother go? I didn't really give any indication of where his brother went. Really, how far could he have gone? Unless he's being held in the castle, but I can't enter the castle. I suppose we could also check out Kamio quickly. Neo Tokyo. Kamio is the island. Oh, I can't speak English very well. That's different than what he used to say. Okay, she says the same thing that she used to say, though. Oh, maybe I just didn't talk to the other guy. Because, yeah, I, I just assumed they all say the same thing. to prove him wrong. This place is supposed to be one of those trendy <laughs> spots. Check it out. Oh, we have a peeping Tom on our hands. And they tell us to come back when we're uh, older. Yep.
So I'm not really sure that there's anything new to do here yet either. I already did that. Got Magirock for out eating some dude. what this guy's deal was. Alright, he just lets you eat stuff. I think, uh, I don't think we're gonna find our guy here. I think there's, like, nothing in any of these rooms. This is probably the stopover. Yep. It is pretty ridiculous that I can fly across a stopover and then have my boat on the other side. It certainly avoids a the inconvenience that FF4 kind of subjects the player to. Because eventually you have two airships, but only one can carry the hovercraft. And it's like, you can end up totally out of place. I don't suppose there's anything else we can do in here? No. As far as I can tell, this is just one screen. But then what the heck am I supposed to be doing now? Because unfortunately, the fortune teller still tells us uh, about the shoes. It's like, been there, done that, got the shoes. Now what? Hey, Jimmy. Well, I'm kind of lost. We, we have uh, arguably a new progression item, but I don't know how it's progression. Ostensibly, this is the town that I should be in right now. Nothing actually down here, right? No. Suppose I can double check if anybody says anything different. I suppose Shija is also somebody we should be looking for. So there's ostensibly two people we're looking for. One is Shija and one is Lon's brother. Long, I believe. And this is the guy who says that there's a treasure called Speed Shoes, which I have now. But the problem is it's not immediately evident what the Speed Shoes do. I mean, like, they make you go faster, sure, but, like, what is that actually useful for?
don't know that I've checked for NPCs in here. That's like the only other thing I can think of. Oh, hey. Look at men come here. This room for ladies. Pretty traveler, she suddenly gets sick. Oh, well, I might have something, uh... I might have something to help. What? Oh my god, it's her! You've got to be kidding me. Why did she get sick, though? But fortunately, we might have something for this situation. Or it won't let us do anything with it. Like, I have the fever medicine equipped. Maybe I have to talk to the doctor now? I can't believe I never went up there. Alright, so... I already forgot where the doctor was. It's not up here, is it? Nope. Wrong house entirely. Are you a friend with sick lady at in? She's suffered. She has fever and bad dream. She cannot escape her nightmare. A herbal medicine called ginseng could... Or ginseng, I guess is how we pronounce it. Um, could end your friend's nightmare. Lon Trading sells ginseng before, but now Lon go out of business. No more ginseng. I need some too. So now we have a reason to talk to Lon. Let's make sure that the other girl here doesn't say anything new. Oh, same thing. house is here. The one door that doesn't look like any other door. What you want? The doctor told me you had an herb called ginseng. My friend is ill and needs it. Can you sell some? I have no business anymore. You go away now. Oh yeah. You wait. Maybe ginseng could be available. Want to make a deal? Okay. Deal? What do you mean by deal? I have a younger brother. Wow. We run this business together before. But Wong, he leave town one day. Okay, he's narrating the, the flashback here. He leave town one day. Nobody know where he go. I couldn't find him either, so, alright. Somebody buy Dragoon Castle. I think Wong. But I also hear not good things. I hear he buying up many things and keep them at Dragoon Castle. I have bad feeling Wong is involved in some bad business. I give you some ginseng. You check on Wong. If Wong do bad things, I want to stop him. This for me? Sure. You sure care about your brother. I'll go check on him. If you do that, you're a good man. This is ginseng. It works for any disease. You have to friend right away. Didn't expect them to give it to us before we did stuff for them. Okay. Now the question is, do we have to take it to the doctor, or can we take it directly to... our friend over here? What did you do with this ginseng? I had her ask the doctor. Maybe the doctor's gonna require us to do something else. Alright, doctor was... Here? I think. You got some ginseng! You make sick person that didn't drink this, but be careful. If no- it no good just drinking ginseng. Get rid of, cause bad dream, too. What? Try hard. That last message did not make any sense. Oh, you get rid of cause of bad dream. Like... I was- I was reading cause as, like, because, but that's not what he meant. 
should probably save. I haven't in a bit. Alright, so now do we have... We still have ginseng, okay. You could drink the ginseng, then remove the nightmare's cause. Nightmare's cause? How do I get rid of that? Well, we just saved anyway. I have to do something, she's really suffering. Just like get sucked into her uh, flashback here. Your Highness, we found no trace of a treasure here. Enough. But there is a treasure in this village for certain. The village head has a daughter. Find her and take her to the castle. So this is when he massacred the village. Ida, I am merciful. No, you're not. Let us give a chance to the village head. Inquire the whereabouts of the treasure. They refuse to compi comply, kill them yourself. Why don't you kill them, you bastard? Don't make her do your dirty work, no wonder she's having nightmares. The others shall be killed by our men. Your Highness, they are nothing but innocent villagers. Oh, Fida, you would disagree with me then? Yeah. You cannot refuse me who has raised an orphan like you. Now go! Total surrender or death. And then he proceeds to walk through her. I understand. Do not look so stricken. As guardians of the treasure, we steeled ourselves to this fate. We cannot reveal the treasure's location even for our lives. Hurry. Execute us now, lest they turn on you. But we have but one request. Our daughter, Elle. We beg that you protect her. Sorry. Sorry, I can't save you. Sorry. But I promise I will always protect your daughter, even with my life. You know. I killed the princess's father and mother. I'm the cause of all her miseries. I never escape this curse of guilt. You must think me vicious. It's not true. You protected her just like you promised. It does not absolve me of my crimes. So what? So you're gonna quit protecting Elle? Get it together. If you don't protect Elle, who will? Castle. Must hurry. Why would she, why would the princess be there? Really much better now. She'll certainly become better. But yeah, why would Elle be here? I mean, we know Elle flew the coop after she killed the king, but... I wonder if you actually fail if you just... Stay silent. Okay, so... Wait, what the hell are you doing here? Hey, there you are. I was looking for your... Yeah, you got a little bit lost, dude. I'm sorry, how did you use your skateboard to tread water across the Pacific Ocean? Anita told me you helped Will. You even went to Yunko looking for airplane parts for Will. That's great of you, so I decided I'll join you and help you. So, you discover anything? I discovered that Lon's brother Wong is buying up certain materials. He appears to be involved in some... Sh something shady at Dragoon Castle. I heard that too, the guy who bought the castle. Yeah, I can feel my spine tingling. Now I know something's up. 
Yo, bro, let's hit the castle. Full frontal assault. Yep. I mean, given given that guy's all-terrain vehicle of a skateboard, he could probably just, like, crash through the roof or something. Uh, but okay, I guess- oh, maybe he's just gonna take out the guard for us? That would be pretty hilarious. Is there anything else I want to do here first? I don't think so. Um... Let's see what happens here. Ooh, This is Dragoon Castle, would you look at that? No time for gawking, let's get a move on. Hey, bro. While I attract some attention, you slip inside the castle. Ready? Let's go. Is he just gonna distract them? He's really just gonna distract- he's gonna make them dizzy is what he's gonna do. What? <laughs> okay, or he's gonna do that. Oh. Wow, we actually get to keep this music on? That's pretty funny. Uh, Alright, I need to equip these again. No, don't leave, jeez. Pretty good timing there. Oh no, this is this freaking stealth castle. Oh god, alright, I'm gonna save and take a break. <laughs> and then we will attempt stealth castle, I guess. I wonder if it's really gonna toss me out, or if I just need to beat things up if I fail the stealth checks. We'll find out in a bit. Okay. Let's see how poorly this goes, because I am not good at stealth sections. Let's also see how forgiving it is, I guess. So I suppose I should look at the map. There is no map. Hmm. Okay. There's another door over there, too. So there's there's no map. But there are options. Oh, god damn it. So do they just kick me out? They do just kick me out. Okay. Oh. Good start. Oh, I thought I wanted to see how tunnel vision D would be. So that doesn't work. You piece of crap! You can't just turn 180 degrees immediately. Oh, why can't I just beat these guys up? It would be so much easier. Oh god, they can frickin' scan the upper level too. there's any consequence to this, but... Oh wait, can I crash into this though? It doesn't seem to do anything. I, I still don't understand the point of these shoes. That was a terrible idea. Let's just get thrown out, why not? I feel like I gotta sneak by that guy in the bottom left. Although, wait. Wasn't there a way to drop down here? Or was that... No, that was further over there. Did that just go back out, or is this different? No, I'm pretty sure that's where I came in. Yeah, so you can drop down there, but I don't know what the point of doing that is. And you can't drop down there. So it's like, can I do something about this guy or not? Nope, I guess I can just get lucky. Um...
Well, if he's not gonna move, then I'm kinda screwed, right? What is going on with this place? Wait, is this a door? No. I still don't know why I have these shoes. Like, I don't know what they do for me. Wow, okay. And I'm really sure that there's nothing up here. Also, apparently I just have to press the X button. Oh, wait, there's totally something up here. Oh, can I dash off of this? No. Can I push these? No. But yeah, like, as far as I can tell, the shoes are completely irrelevant. Oh, I didn't go in here. So are these guys actually deterministic? Oh, he actually moves. trust that middle portion. Probably faster to re-enter the room. There's no way I can do that on the first try, though, I don't think. Well, maybe there is. Hang on. Question is, is there another dude up here? Okay, no. Okay, so I can't jump with these shoes. So, what? Good job, idiot. Oh, actually, wait. Okay, first of all, there's a side here. Second of all, I don't even have a life meter. Okay, it looks like I can't get over here. Nope, I can. So I figured the door at the top at the beginning there is probably a trap. I suppose there could be extra stuff. Stairs? That is stairs. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Also, this layout feels familiar. feels reminiscent of something from Loran, I think. Do I want to check the other areas? Back up here first. Oops, wasn't paying attention. Oh, you jerk. Is this a trap? Oh, that's not even... <laughs> I mistook that for, like, steps or something, but it's actually nothing. Alright, so then we're going down here. Uh, not down there. Over here. Oh, 
And this is reminiscent of... Was it the Spain castle, I guess, that had... Yeah, basically had all the same... Tile sets and whatnot. Seems like we're getting into dangerous territory here. Oh, no. Alright, what is it this time? Is it another weapon? What other weapons can I get rid of? I don't know if there was any special meaning to this one. Like, that one had meaning back in the first area, but probably doesn't need anything else. Like, I mean, it hasn't meant anything since then, so I could get rid of it. I guess I'll get rid of this one first. Defense slightly. Okay. Let's see how slightly is slightly. So right now our defense is 52 plus 43. That went down. So either that was already raising defense more than this one, or... I don't know, that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Oh wait, is there... hang on, can I go anywhere else in here? Doesn't seem like it, but there is also a hint of... something over there. Question is, where else can I go? I really can't believe there's no map in this place. has seemed pretty linear, which is really what has me doubting that I should be going back. But also, why would it give me a weapon in a place where I can't even attack things? Oh, well, I guess we'll go back. Let's see if there was anywhere else I could go. doors in here either. I'm surprised I didn't mess up those jumps. I 
really want to think that's a door. I mean, like, there's torches in front of it and everything. Seems kind of important. That does not work. I can't believe they make you do a diagonal jump there, though. That's ridiculous. I feel like there's no reason to go back there, though. I mean, you can't be telling me the only purpose is to get that weapon, because that doesn't make any sense to me. Unless that weapon actually counts as plain parts, but... What did the description of this say? It just says that. Sure there's nowhere else to go in here? There's definitely stuff to the left of this. Can I charge through these? that they would have you go all the way out to come all the way back in somewhere else. But that's kind of what I have to imagine at this point. I guess that's what we're going to try doing. even if it makes me sad. Because I really don't want to have to ever go through the hallway before this room again. Wow, that counted? Okay. Can't believe that guy didn't even see me on the way out. Alright, so I can drop down from here. Are there any doors I didn't go through in here, though? Because there was that one, which I went through and seemingly had nothing. Or actually, no. Was it the one up here that had nothing? Yeah, what is the deal with this? Still looking for any excuse for these speed shoes to actually function. Other than just making you go fast. Also, why are these torches so dim? Like, the entire room is dim. Seems like they should be uh, more effective than that. Like, at least light them up. was through the middle door. Wasn't there just a dude standing there that I couldn't do anything about? Oh god, this guy just 
So, like, some of the other dudes... Yeah, so, like, see... When they do a 180... I can't believe I got away with that. When they do a 180... They just snap. Like that. But when they do a 90 degree turn... Then they actually gradually... Turn. So there's no way past this guy. Or there is a way past this guy. Okay, I stand corrected. And then there's another one, and I just got extremely lucky. What is this level design? And there's... Oh, I can open that one. There, our speed shoes just served a purpose. That did not work on the other one in that other area between the two torches, though. Which looked a lot like that to me. Oh no, there's still more of this crap. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Is this- are we effectively Pac-Man now? Oh Jesus fucking Christ. And it throws you all the way out so you have to do all that over again. Cool, I got away with that one. I don't think I'm ever gonna manage to get in there again, because I don't even know how this worked. Yeah, <laughs> And they can just turn a 180 whenever they feel like it. This is actual garbage game design. Yeah, what are you gonna do? I, I was not trusting that he wasn't gonna 180. How the hell did I get through this room, dude? Like, holy shit. Especially the one at the top. That I have absolutely zero confidence that I will ever get through again. And the problem is, like, they can basically do whatever they want whenever they want. I don't think there's any rhyme or reason to when they switch. Like, at least if it were on a constant interval. It might be on a constant interval, but they are allowed to switch. But they don't always switch on that interval. How did you spot me? Are you somebody's mother with eyes in the back of your head? This is making me want to give up on this playthrough. This is bad. Like, the one time I got through there, I had no right to get through there, even. And I still have no idea how I did it. I want to see if he catches me, if he rotates down. And he just snapped and did a 180. The beam is apparently more narrow than it makes you think, though. By how I haven't been seen at some points. Will they see me here? Oh, I should have tried it. Actually, I shouldn't have tried it there because I would have been caught. Okay, now he sees you there.
that guy actually did a, one, uh, a 90 degree turn really quickly. Like, I feel like these guys don't do that. Okay, that also works. Like, I don't think there's a set pattern to it. Is there? It seems completely random. And then, like, you have- there's no way. You don't have time. And you're just completely guessing. Like, am I missing something here? Should I have an item that trivializes this? Because this seems... ...trivial to fail, and ex extremely impossible to succeed. It's like, I have to get lightning to strike twice, three times, and then we have to get through the room after that, which also has its own problems. Uh, I got stuck in the corner. <laughs> Alright, that time I- <laughs> That time he just sauntered down and got me immediately. gonna do it again. No, he's not. Okay. Like, if you could constantly keep a diagonal, that would work, but not at this close quarters, you can't. Oh, that's too close. Alright. That doesn't work. supposed to do? You literally cannot. Uh, okay, cool. Like, that one time I got in there was absolutely a fluke. I feel like this isn't intended to work. But I'm not sure what else I can do. He's teasing me hard here. Like, he just didn't look down here at all. Oh, god damn it. And I always bias to the left, and that's always where he ends up going, right when I get up there. Like, they can't really intend for the game to be this bad, right? Because this is actually... Like, this isn't even red light, green light. This, is, this game had that too, but that actually worked. Ah, uh, this is just... bad. That time I got stuck in the corner. I don't trust this. I just... I can't trust it at all. this guy immediately. I forget where I ended up actually getting caught. He can freaking shine through the wall, so that's great. Alright, we made it through. I don't give a shit if there's anything else in that room. I want to be done with this place. Okay. We made it to the other side.
Somebody thought this was a good idea. Oh. No, I wanted to go down first. Oh. Help. Help. Can't move. Help. How did you end up in this predicament? I'm going down first because there's a... Th I thought there was a thing down here. There's actually nothing down here. Never mind. Wasn't there something down here? Yeah, this. Which is, uh, very disconcerting. What? Did I fuck up, or...? Oh! You had that coming, that's what you get for fooling around. Why are you putting me in jail now? Oh, because she's still jealous because, uh, Elle is our friend. Look, we weren't fooling around. First of all, like, how old is this kid? Twelve? Not ready to have a relationship with a twelve-year-old. Feeling any remorse now? Not at all. What, you self-centered little witch? I like how they purposely centered, uh, censored that. Get me out right now! Oh, how dare you! You're just an uncaring, cold-blooded jerk. Look, just because we already have someone we like doesn't mean we're cold-blooded against everyone else, just because you're the one who's jealous. By the way, I work for Mr. Wong. He gave me this order. Lose Kenny forever in this dark and cold dungeon. Why do you work for Mr. Wong? Is that a recent development? You can just die and rot here. It'll make me feel better. I swear she's 12. Heh, <laughs> even a rut like that's a woman. Hell hath no fury. Instead of blathering, how about finding us a way out? Hey, keep it cool, keep it cool. Good things, right? <sighs> Useless twit. Why do I always have to take this? Darn it. I'm gonna sulk. Wait, are we actually sulking right now? Meanwhile... It just mirrors her hair a completely different color than what we just saw. Oh, look who it is. Ugh, finally I catch up with you. I careless think you just go. You kill King Henry, then run away. I look hard for you, Ella Stockholm. It's you. You killed my parents and everyone in the village. Wait. Not according to the dream we saw. That not true. And Henri's job to collect information. Oh, okay, so Henri was doing this guy's bidding. So, uh, it's even worse. He failed, too. My job just to deliver collected information and money. It's the same thing. I don't know who's behind you. Your people killed innocent people for your own ends. Ho ho ho, guilty or innocent, not matter. Necessary or not is problem. That day will come, when only necessary people will live forever. Why would you want to know about the treacherous and tiny village? Enough talking, young lady. You tell me honestly. You think about it good. Better if you talk before you get hurt. You, bodyguard, you keep watch on girl. Oh, do we get to fight this jerk now? I met you at Loire Castle. I visited the king. And you were a groom candidate. You were together with those men, weren't you? Who knows? I'm just a drifter, working for a fistful of gems. I don't enjoy hurting women. You be still now. Hey, cut your sulking already. I heard something above. So what? What'll that do for us? We're not gonna make it this time. Oh, I see. Well, if you so dearly love your present state, I shan't complain. I merely suggest that we try something, hero, rather than moaning. A little later. The sound, huh? Well, it's worth checking out. So last time I tried falling down the hole and nothing happened. Should I fall down the hole now? Is someone down there? Yeah, who are you? Wait, really? It's me, Fida. I'll get you out, just wait. Oh, it's Fida. I'm using the slightly wrong voice. Grab this chain and haul, your haul yourself up. How did Fida get here that... I mean, wasn't she still recovering? 
It is not like you to be caught so easily. What happened? Not saying. No, I'll say. No big deal. I was playing with the self centered brat for a bit. Fine, but why did you come? You knew it's dangerous here. Why did you come here? I mean, technically, I did come for the airplane parts. Uh, but we found out the princess was here too, so. You were saying the Princess L was here while you were feverish. For some reason, I found myself here. I don't know why myself. I see. Then our objectives coincide. You give me courage. The Princess isn't here. The west side was a dead end. I'm going to the east of the castle. Take care. I was already over there. That was also a dead end. Can I use weapons now? No. And now we're back in this room again. So now is the east side no longer going to be a dead end? Should I actually just have them toss me? I'm gonna get tossed as soon as I go down here anyway. Like, why do they still make you sneak around at this point? It feels like at this point they should just let you go wild. Whoop. Where's the door over here? It is on the top level. How did I get up there before? Wait a minute. Like, did I actually get past this guy? You piece of shit. You and your frickin' snap 180 degree no scope turns. Well, I walked right into that one as it happened. Told me, he immediately stopped and turned around. Like, I was up here before once, I would prefer to not have to do this again, but... Are you gonna go up there? I can't do anything until- well, that might have worked, but... You piece of crap. Why don't you walk up like you did the other times? Alright, sure, I lucked out. What the- <laughs> Dude actually does a 360 no-scope. I can't believe this crap. Yeah, does he actually... Yeah, he, he looks all around there, so you can't- I, I feel like you can't actually stop here. I don't know if I can make it past him. I also don't know if he's gonna, like... He always looks left, then right. We've got one shot of this. Alright, that works. Alright, so back to the side we were to- This is a trap, right? Oh, well, that's the place I couldn't open before. Princess Elle is held in here. Please hurry and help her. You're lying, right? Wait, this totally wasn't open before! But why would she... Yeah, this has got to be a trap. Wait, why are there open chests everywhere? At least let me open the chests. That's a raw deal. I can't push these. Wait a second. I can just navigate around them. Can I read these? No. Whoop, yes. Those paths are to be opened by one's own feet and none other. As if they had to tell me that after I've already done it once. Weird that that one specific book was readable, but nothing else is. 
Six lights illuminate a new road by losing six lights? This is, this is another trap, right? Yep, you dummy. Now for the same trick again. Of course I did. Huh. Okay. In your heart exists two L's, above and below ground. Which one do you really like? Do I actually have to choose, or is it just... Don't get duped! This is a mirage! I know. Nightmares sneak into the ga gaps of people's hearts. Believe! Believe in your own strength to defeat nightmares. Yeah, remember you have a frickin' weapon. Use it. Fool people by showing mirages of L's staged misdeeds. Where are you? I know you're in this room. Show yourself! Why are you interfering? Who are you? And who might you be? You appear to know him, but why the torments? Let my feelings. You should suffer. Suffer and suffer in the same way. You're a ditz. Yeah, you show her. You were hurt so you return the pain? You're a child. You should never be in love thinking that way. Says who? Both you and him can be erased by Wong. Some side trip, but <laughs> wow, harsh. Just calling Malin a side trip. Let's go. Oh wow, she's following me now. Okay. I still can't attack though. But I wonder if this means no more guards. The entrance is sealed. It was open before. So I guess we all live here now. Malin, very good. The mouse, they are caught. Mouse, you can chase them, but that is futile. It's finish time now. Malin, I thank you, but you are no longer needed. What? You monster. Wait a second, Mr. Wong, what do you mean? You don't... you don't know? I do same to you as you do to him. He plans to kill us all in this room. Wait, who was saying those lines? Was that still Fida? Why, I worked hard for Mr. Wong. You don't understand, do you? The purely evil treat people like ants. See, if you... Ah, I was stupid! Yes, you were. I'm sorry. Daddy, Grandpa. Is her Grandpa gonna come save us now? What's that sound? What is it now? It's the walls, right? No, nope. what? It's Dogie? Oh. I guess Peril is this game's Dogie. Alright. Yo, if it isn't Kenny. I heard a girl crying, so I came over. Don't make the ladies cry. By the way, you meet the guy that's buying up all the metal? We don't have time making girls cry. Let's get our job done and get out. But this castle is great. Totally perfect for boarding. Yahoo! Okay, did you take out the guards, though? The fuck was that guy? You can get out, huh? I'll be scooting ahead. Wait, did that say scooting or scouting? You're gonna rescue the princess, aren't you? Check the wall opposite the unpaired statue. Behind is the room where the princess is held. Be careful. Roy, the bodyguard hired by Wong, is watching over her. And... I was wrong. Sorry. You were also Wong. The, wait, so check the wall opposite the unpaired statue. Is that in this room, or is that... Where even is that that that's talking about? Is 
Is that back in that other... That's probably back in that room back at the beginning. That I didn't know what the hell to do with. Wait, how did I end up out here? Okay. I guess, no, that's true. That is where I was. Alright, so. Do we still have stupid guards to deal with? Yeah, we sure do. Alright, well, if it's in the room that I think it's in... Let's check here. I don't think there's any statues in this room. Wall opposite the unpaired statue. Well, crap. Do we have to go... Don't, don't make me go down the center again. Or is it here? These are paired, though. Those are paired up. Don't know which room we are looking in. Oh, well, I just got past him by accident. Alright, cool. I guess I'll go back in here and look around. Because I'm not sure where exactly I'm going right now. There were no statues in here, right? And yeah, so she's gone now. Wait, this is the wrong way, isn't it? Oops. Not paying attention. I highly doubt there were any statues all the way down here. Gotta be in one of the main rooms. Like near the beginning. But man, it is pretty ridiculous just how long Malin's story goes on. She keeps turning up again. unpaired statues out here. Oh, it's not on this floor, it's up there. But I already checked that anyway. I think we gotta go through the center again, which is the worst damn part. I really want this room to serve a purpose, but as far as I can tell, it doesn't. Oh, maybe that doesn't actually catch you. Okay. At this point, I'm just freaking stupidly checking everything up here because this is suspicious. Unpaired statue. Up down there. Oh, that's a pair. 
That's an hair. I feel like this is the only room that has these statues in it. Check out here while I'm at. Also, I suppose I can save. Because I haven't done that in a while, and we've been through a lot of crap, although we're not done with all the crap. Actually, I might take one more break. I know I'm taking a lot of breaks tonight, but uh, I'm actually going to, in the off chance that something weird happens, I'm going to save in a separate slot. Um, but yeah, let me take one more break, and we'll see if we can get to the bottom of this when we get back. Alright, I guess we're going through that center door again, which I'm not pleased about because that was impossible. <sighs> Unless... I don't know. The unpaired statue. Like, where else would that be talking about? Like, I want to think it's the main room, but I didn't see any unpaired statues there. And there was nothing on the left, and I couldn't tell anything on the right, either. So, I think we gotta check the center again, which is gonna be impossible. What, really? I was technically holding off. If you don't hold up, you won't get spotted there. I'm pretty sure. Usually this guy is not pointing down right when I get here, so that was kind of surprising. trust this guy at all. See, now he's gravitating towards the right a lot. Alright, we lucked out. Wait, unpaired statue. Here? Maybe? I don't see anything. I'm gonna just try running into things anyway. Even though I don't think I could possibly be here. What about this? I mean, these are kind of paired, but there's these... Well, okay, never mind. Now, now they're actually paired. Have I seen those elsewhere? Oh, jeez, this room? Oh god! Really don't want to get sent back now. Where'd the other guy to go? I don't think there's any other statues in here, though. And I highly doubt there's any statues down here. Wait, did I ever go over here? Oh, 
Oh, this is right. This is the the higher end of that. This thing. Like, this has been suspicious. Well, there's an unpaired pile of bones down there, but it doesn't really help me. Wait, is that where I came from? I think it is. Yeah. Well, I guess we're going back. here without getting caught. Alright, so this is where she brought us back up. I'm gonna get caught as soon as I step out here. No, I'm not. Okay. That looked like it could have been something. It wasn't, though. Oh my god. Oh, I hate this room. But I also don't see... Like, those are both paired. Although there is the fact that that dude freaking like, came out of here, initially. I don't think it's in there. But I haven't seen any unpaired statues anywhere. get caught anyway, because the moment I go out, I'm going to get caught. If I'm going to go get caught anyway... But it did say the wall across from the unpaired statue, right? I find it really interesting that that guy comes out from below here? Which, like, there isn't even space there. How did he get in there to begin with? That was short-lived. Like, unpaired statues, I think it either has to be these, or those golden things. But the problem is, every one I've seen is part of a pair. So where's the unpaired one? like I've looked everywhere. I also really wish there were a map in this. I am surprised he let me by, but okay. Oh, that's right. This guy actually has the pattern. Hang on. See, when they actually have a pattern... And that makes things reasonable. Imagine that. Oops. Alright, so this was the room that Maylin was in. Where she said, inspect the wall across from the unpaired statue. There are no statues in here. This exist. That has been very suspicious to me the whole time. But I, whoops, wow, couldn't put on the brakes. Apparently we're Luigi now. Uh, yeah, there's no statues over here, though. It might have actually worked if I hadn't just stopped and second-guessed myself. I 
nobody looked through here again. Like, what the heck are they looking for? It's got to be something more obvious than what I'm attempting at this point. And now we're back in this section again, which seems unlikely to be it. Because that just goes down to the dungeon again. Like, the deeper I get into any particular end of this, the further off I feel like I am, because there's no statues here. And I would also- whoops, forgot I can't do that. I would also kind of imagine I should be looking for a topside door. It also seems really weird that Mei Lin just completely disappeared, though. I still don't understand why that book isn't here when you already had to have used the, uh... Well, I guess not. I guess if I hadn't gone to the right side before. Six lights illuminate a new road by losing six lights. We haven't figured out what that one means yet. That's talking about the left room. But how do you lose six lights? Like, I can't attack in here. I would imagine I can't use magic either. It's allegedly allowing me to select magic? And I can go back to that. It might not let me use it anyway. I think I, I think it actually like lets you menu in, but then when you try to use it, it's like I can't do that now. <laughs> Incorrect direction. Diagonals are impossible. I don't know why they decided to make diagonals impossible, but they sure did do that. Oh, come on. So yeah, losing six lights. It's talking about this. The question is, how do you lose six lights? Can I run into them? Oh, wait. I need to... Let me try equipping that again. Did I not try running into the torches before? Also, is there anything in here I can use right now? No, I don't think so. That doesn't seem to work. And I can't just walk up to them and interact. Is there anything else that would... Do I even have any magic that would, like, ostensibly do something? Was this the one that What's-His-Face... 
Oh, cures all Abner Rat Mallies. No, we don't want to use that right now. Which one was the one that, uh... Well, let's just see if it even lets me use this. I did save. We haven't done anything useful since I came back after we had saved. Yeah, it doesn't let me use it anyway. Because we are in a non-combat zone. By removing six lights... Wait, can I throw shit at it? Is this supposed to be water? You piece of shit, that's supposed to be water. If the room were well lit to begin with, this would be more evident. But for some reason the room is already dark. Even though the torches are lit. Okay. Hello, come to Papa. And that sure looks like a mismatched statue to me right there. So what else is going on in this room? This looks like I should charge it. Alright, it seems like there's no guards in here. And also is not open. These do not look mismatched. The ones over on the other side, that looked like a mismatched, you know, an unpaired statue. I think we're in the right place now. Oh, I just was too far up. That's it. This is the unpaired statue Malin was talking about. Wonder what I should do. Scary, don't. Oh, go, push it. Okay, what about the other side, though? Did that open that, too, or did it really just open the one side? Looks like it really just opened the one side. That's the wrong hallway. Alright, let's see what we can do. Okay, that one I have to run into. All this head trauma. Are you really all, or is Malin just pulling my leg again? I can't believe it. Imagine meeting you at a place like this. I didn't think I would ever see you again. I always wanted to see you again. Is this a dream? Hey. Look who it is. Sorry, boy. I have no ill will, but this is my business. I always wanted to see how good you were. This is a good opportunity. Are we fighting now? <clears throat> no need. I shall be your opponent. Alright, nope, we're not fighting. As much as we wanted to fight the jerk that was literally labeled jerk before we knew his name was Royd. Get the princess out of this castle. Wait, so now you're drawing weapons? This would have been a lot easier if we just did that all along. What are you doing? Hurry! Sorry boy, it looks like our match will have to wait another day. Yeah, I'm sure we'll fight him eventually. He's like the, uh, that dude in- oh, hello. This way! You can't get past the guards with the princess, I know a hidden way. Don't worry, I won't dupe you again, follow me! Damn, she runs fast. I'm gonna assume she's going over here. Alright, I'm glad the princess didn't follow my blunt head trauma idea. Alright, so she's over there. Is there still really nothing in here? Because, I mean, I still think that wall looks suspiciously blank. There's a train up ahead. I heard Mr. Wonk say it leads outside. Get in. Okay. I have met you before. Was it Loire Castle? No, oh, even before that somewhere. It's an honor to have someone as beautiful as you remember me. The sword does not sit well with the beauty. Lay your weapon down. Enough blather, draw your sword! Any who wish to harm the princess answers to me. Let me ask you something. What compels you to fight so much? 
That girl is no longer a princess. You should be free to leave. I told you, a drifter like you would never understand. Someone to be protected exists. I fight for her, that's all. I want to protect. Understood. Go. I won't stop you. What do you mean? Isn't it your job to kill us? I changed my mind. That's all. Now go. Protect your precious princess well. Alright. Maybe maybe Roy's not a jerk? Question mark? Also, this... This this music definitely feels like it's got slight yeast vibes or something to it. Wait, I'm gonna wait for Fida. Fida always cared about me. I can't leave her here. Please go ahead. I'll follow with Fida. This is not gonna turn out well. burdens you anymore. There are many things that I must do. She's actually a secret agent. Ah, oh, no, my goodness, no! If Dr. Baruga and Mosk find out, he'll be super angry. Roy, you catch Alan dispose of this mouse right now. The mastermind is Baruga. Now we know the name. What are you saying? If you're not going out, you're fired. Well, you couldn't have not know. In that work you call preparation, many people have died. Among them, my closest friend. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. King Henri is already dead. It's just you and that Baruga you mentioned. No, stop. No, be hasty. What are you, a fucking at now? All right, so Roy's got his own quest. All right, I can respect that then. Can I go back up? And she's gone. Wait. <laughs> They're in mad pursuit of his mirage. Where's the princess? What are you... Didn't you see her? Not me, I thought she was with you! What? What? The castle! Oh no. Wong was a load-bearing boss. Are you really alright? Didn't you die? It's not gonna die that easily. Whoa! You all right? Aren't you hurt? The castle suddenly collapsed and we were shot up the drain. Yo, bro, you okay? I'm glad you're safe. I heard in town the price of metal's coming back down. Not to go help Will, it's gonna get busy. You come see Will too. You'll be amazed at what he's making. Okay then. Sorry, I did something terrible. You never gave up on me, you saved me. You haven't come to hate me, that's good enough for now. Hey, I'm going to back I'm going back to Grandpa, back to Lahasa. I'll visit sometime, okay? Oh, so that'll actually change things now. Back to being alone. Wonder what happened to the princess and the lady knight. Oh yeah, metal prices are dropping. We should go to Nur Lake. That airplane guy is probably happily back at work by now. Didn't we have to get stuff for him here though? I'm a little confused at how the metal price has already dropped. Like, damn, imagine if scaring an AI bro were enough to make this entire LLM craze ass. Of course, AI bros are not easily scared, or at least not easily scared by what should scare them. Which is using technology they don't understand. Okay, um... Well, let's save first. And I guess we should go see Lon here. Uh, he's in here. Did she say anything different? Nope, same thing. I need to say anything. I know my brother was doing bad things. 
Can I go and castle eat my brother for punish- for- wait, what? Eat my brother for punish him doing bad things there. Oh, are we assuming he's dead now? I mean, I guess. I, I, I don't think that's quite accurate, but close enough. I'm glad you stopped him doing worse bad things. Okay, so there's probably nothing else to do here right now. Actually, does the doctor have anything new to say? Sick girl better? Best thing to treat her with love. Number one. Actually, yeah, let's check the hotel then, because, like, is that room not occupied now? This room or the other room? The other room. Yep, totally empty. Alright. Perhaps we should just leave it there for tonight. I did just save there. So. Uh, yeah, boy. That was the worst dungeon of the game, and it wasn't even a proper dungeon because there was no attacking to be done whatsoever. Man. Actually, I'm curious about one thing. Since the castle supposedly, allegedly imploded, let's go check if we can not get into it anymore. All well, the music changed. Oh, okay, right. I didn't even try going up before, so yeah, naturally, we, we can't actually go in. Alright, that settles that idea. Um, so the bridge is absolutely busted, so yep, that's totally off-limits now. So, I'm guessing the next play is to actually- well, no, so we've got two options. One is go to Lahasa and visit Meilin, and the other is go to Nur Lake and visit Well, who is supposedly back working on the plane again. So, uh, we've got options for whenever I pick this back up again.